An Ohio lawmaker is going to make a Crimes Against Humanity referral for President Trump over promoting an unproven drug combination to treat coronavirus. While announcing that the U.S. has bought a great deal of it, the president touted the anti-malarial drug hydroxychloroquine as a way to treat COVID-19. The Hill reports that the drug has yet to be proven to work and that the U.S. Food and Drug Administration has not approved it. Following the briefing, a Democratic state representative in Ohio wrote on Twitter, quote, Today's press conference was the last straw. They say taking it before the fact is good, but what do you have to lose? Tavia Golonsky added that she would be making a referral for crimes against humanity to The Hague, which is the UN's International Court of Justice. The Akron, Ohio lawmaker asked for lawyers with experience in international cases to contact her. This is not the first time Trump has sung the praises of hydroxychloroquine. After a tweet in March, the FDA announced that the drug commonly used to treat malaria, lupus, and rheumatoid arthritis was in short supply after a surge in demand. Live Science reports that an Arizona couple in their 60s attempted to self-medicate with chloroquine phosphate shortly after Trump's post. The man died and the wife was hospitalized. 